Well, one man's trash is an artist's treasure. At least that's the case for this Bay Area park. John Bartel here, making a little pit stop at the Albany Bowl. Concrete, rebar, and all sorts of building materials. That's what you're gonna be walking on at the Albany Bulb. So before this was a park, this was actually a giant landfill. Trash all over the place here. The Albany Bulb is a man-made piece of land created as a result of dumping construction debris from 1963 to 1983. And during that time, trash was polluting the water and caught the attention of environmental group Save the Bay. And thanks to the Save the Bay group, they ended up stopping the landfill here and turning it into a park. Locals around here simply call the park the Bulb, and that's because the peninsula of the park leads to a bulb-shaped piece of land with a number of trails. One of the things you'll definitely notice on this trail, it's pretty sticky out here. Back in the day, they used to have methane fires from this landfill. Not all the trails are well marked or handicap accessible, but each path has its own uniqueness. Eventually, artists took note of the place, and in the 90s, they started decorating. Like most art, it's up to interpretation. Some displays are just more interesting than others. These are called concrete currents. There's a bunch of them. I think that's a jellyfish in that tree over there. You definitely want some adult supervision when you come here. Playground equipment's not very safe. The bulb has become a popular place to walk dogs, go for a hike, or take pictures for social media. The rock labyrinth at the end of the park is really popular, especially at sunset. It's a fun, free, and unique way to experience the Bay Area. Well, the island may be a dump, but you sure do get a pretty view of the city. In Albany, I'm John Bartell. Hope to see you on the back roads. God, it smells here.